Hi guys, Tina here. So I am here to share a haul with you guys. Um, actually, this I had purchased from YourScrapbookSupply.com like three weeks ago. Um, it came last week, but it's one of the mini um, Gorgeous Girl stamps. And this one is called the Black Star. She is so stinking cute. And they are actually a really nice size, so I'm going to be excited to color that. Okay, so last week... I went to, um, actually I went shopping. I went to Michael's, Joann's, Hobby Lobby, Tuesday morning. And guess what, guys? This is the only thing I purchased. <laughs> I know, crazy, huh? But um, I just didn't see a whole lot. Actually, it wasn't last week. It was the week before. Because um, they had great sales last week, and I missed out. Uh, I picked up the We Are Memory Keepers um, embossing folders. There's two of them. They are the triangles. So you get these two designs. They were four bucks. So I thought that was a really good deal. So I picked that up. Okay. Um, I did happen to run to Hobby Lobby last week. Um, I picked up some of their white and black heavyweight cardstock. And it's actually pretty sturdy. So I just picked up black and white because you can never have enough black and white cardstock, it seems like. They have a lot of stuff on clearance, um, but before I show the clearance stuff with you, I picked up this Pebbles uh, Adhesive Back Butterflies. I thought these were absolutely gorgeous. I thought these would be really pretty on a layout. Um, $3.99 original, but I think they were 40% off, their Easter stuff. So I did pick that up. And then their clearance stuff. I wanted this um, at Christmas time, but I never did purchase it. It's the Sizzix... Um, Tim Holtz Alterations um, Holiday Word Scripts. So there's 17 dies in here, which is $11.99, which is like 40% off. Um, so I thought that was a pretty good deal. I know it's not half price. It probably would have went cheaper, but there are so many people in the town that I basically work in, not live in, but once stuff goes on clearance, they just eat it up. So I made sure I grabbed that. Um, I picked up the Tim Holtz Chit Chat Seasonal stickers. I thought these would be great to put on layouts. So I picked those up, $2.99. Uh, I got the stencil for $3.29 for my art journal when I do my art journal pages. And I really should share some of my art journal pages because um, I guess I kind of keep that personal more like, so I don't really share that. But maybe I'll share that one day. And then I did get the Life Quote Rub-Ons by Tim Holtz for my art journal pages. So those were $2.39. That stencil was $3.29. So they have lots of stuff on clearance. Go check it out. Okay, and then I placed an order at Simon Says Stamp. If you want to save $5, the code is REFRESH, all in caps. And that's good until May 1st. So I've been wanting this stitched dress-up tag dye for the longest time. So I finally got it. It was finally back in stock. I know I have a lot of tag dies, but I just thought these were really cute. So I picked that up. I picked up the big hello die, which for cards, which that's the actual size, which is super amazing. Love that. So I got that. Um, I picked up the spellbinders, these crosses. You actually get three crosses in here. Let me pop them out of there so you can see them a little bit better. Um, I just thought these were really pretty, and I actually used one on a card, and I'll share that with you. So you get three different crosses. Perfect for Easter, sympathy cards, thinking of you cards, baptism, first communion, anything like that, or just because. So I got those. And then I did pick up this Concord and Ninth Floral and Flutter dies, which I already used these as well. So I'll show you those here in a few minutes on the cards that I made. They're really pretty dies. I got the Wildflower stamp set from Concord and Ninth. Super pretty. I picked up this Clearly Besotted So To Speak too. I just thought it was really cute with these smaller speech bubbles and then all of these different words. You're amazing. Hello. Let's celebrate. Happy Easter. Let it snow. Happy New Year. I adore you. Hey, cutie pie. You're so cool. You're a star, nom nom. Um, happy Christmas, you rock, well done, let's party, one more sleep, and congratulations. So, super cute. 
And then I got the Winnie and Walter Kindness, which I thought was really, really pretty. So you get all these different trees, leaves, this cactus, um, the word kindness, and then all these other little words that you can put with it. So I got that. Now, I've been making cards like crazy, you guys. Now, a lot of the stuff, I just did a 15-minute challenge to myself. And it looks like one of my sequins fell off. Um, I did a 15 minute challenge to myself and I posted it on Instagram how fast, you know, or how much you can get accomplished in 15 minutes. I timed myself on my phone and I got my desk pretty much clean to where I can craft. So I did put some of my stamps away, but the first one is the CC Designs Moose Scene. This is the stamp set I used and I made a card with it. I just used my, um... Distress inks. So I'll just kind of show you these really quick. Um, this one was an MFT stamp, which I can see I'm losing sequins. I must not have put enough um, glue on the back of this one, but I'll re glue that on. Um, this is an MFT stamp set out of this world, and I just did a gatefold type card. I still have to do the inside, but um, I used my ink tense pencils to color them up, and then I used some glossy accents on them. This one I used um, Your Next Stamp. It's one of the sports ones, and it says Hoopy Birthday, and I used some doodle bug paper in the background. Super cute. Um, just a simple masculine um, birthday card. I embossed this, cut it out of the diagonal. I um, actually used some brads, but I popped the backs off, put some foam tape on there, and glued them on. Um, hooray, it's your day. This one is where I used the um, Spellbinder die. I cut it out, and then I embossed it with one of my embossing folders. And I used the You're in My Prayers stamp and die set from Simon Says Stamp. So, and I inked around the edges of the cross. Here's just a simple happy birthday masculine one. I just punched out a bunch of different circles from some more masculine patterns. And then this happy birthday one. I used my fringe scissors down here to do a fringe. Die cut the happy, stamp the birthday. And then here's the one where I used that Concord and Ninth butterfly. And it just says happy birthday. And then I used an embossing folder and a punch. And same on this one, embossing folder and a punch. And then here's that flower, and I just stamped happy birthday. Just really basic, simple, fast cards. And then I think this one is probably my favorite. And I see I lost another sequence. Huh. Yeah, they're both right there. Okay. Um, I put some sequins on the top, the bottom. I did a banner. I used one of my banner punches. I um, used some twines or some twine for some bows. And just stamped, it's your birthday. So just some super simple cards, um, and that is it, guys. So I hope you're having a great day, and I will talk to you guys all soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.